Hey guys, Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So today we got some Tron TRX news today and uh, some mining rig updates. All right, be back in a bit. All right, before we go on, guys, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon below. I got something going on called Bitcoin Fridays, where I give away Bitcoin every Friday. So to be uh, notified, just subscribe, hit that bell icon, and you'll know when that video comes out to where you can enter to win. All right, so let's get into it. All right, so let's go over and check out the news first. Uh, here we are on Cointelegraph. Um, report Tron cryptocurrency founder acquired BitTorrent. Um, software company BitTorrent, BitTorrent Inc. has reportedly been sold to blockchain entrepreneur and developer of the Tron platform, Justin Sun. Variety reported June 11th, which was yesterday. The acquisition ostensibly closed last week with BitTorrent management informing staff about the deal. According to a source aware of the transaction, the company's employees have been, not, have been advised not to release any information. Variety reported that some of the stakeholders have also been contacted by the transfer agent who was hired for the deal. No financial details of the acquisition have been available as of press time. Last month, Cointelegraph reported that BitTorrent was in the process of being acquired by founder Tron founder. Sun reportedly entered into negotiations with BitTorrent in September of last year and signed a letter of intent to purchase in January. The deal was suspended because BitTorrent started negotiating with additional bidders, which ran contrary to the agreement. Uh, Sun later uh, suspended that lawsuit. Um, Sun eventually dismissed the lawsuit and registered a company called Rainberry Acquisition, Inc., at the beginning of last year, BitTorrent had renamed his business entity to Rainberry Inc. So that's pretty much writing on a wall right there. Uh, last week, Rainberry Acquisition Inc. reportedly filed a change of status with the California Secretary of State due to a merger. BitTorrent's Rainberry Inc. also filed for a merger on the very same day. So it looks like, uh, speculatively speaking, this is a done deal. Tron will now own BitTorrent. The question is, what are they going to be doing with BitTorrent? And how is that going to help that company? And more importantly, the price here of Tron. Which, for my sake and um, a lot of other people out there, I hope it, hope it bumps that price up. Uh, the file sharing service BitTorrent, which shut down its live streaming business last year, was developed by Bram Cohen. Cohen reportedly left the company for a CEO position at Chia, a San Francisco-based company focused on improving cryptocurrency infrastructure. Let's go over here real quick and see what we're looking at on the coin market cap and see where Tron is at. Still sitting at 10, I'm sure. Yes, at four and a half cents and down 2% today. Uh, along with most everything else. So, it doesn't seem like that news, it's not official yet, but if you ask me, I don't think that news is going to do anything for the price. For some reason, Tron is just either trading level or going down. It doesn't matter what kind of information comes out about it. It just seems to keep going down. But, I can't sell it now. Look at Verge right now, 0 0.0287. Wow, that's gone way down. Anyways, yeah, it doesn't seem like anything that um, Tron does. Any, I mean, they've done a ton of deals behind the scenes, but nothing seems to be bumping that bottom line up, which is the price of Tron. So it is what it is. I mean, you just got to hold it at this point and hope it goes up. So let's check out uh, my sheet here. Um, $36.06 this week so far. We have 628 electronium mine, giving me a grand total of 1,550 total electronium. Still sitting with that amount of birds, 37.75, 25.15 Raven, 
Total Tron 1771 and 110 Gardano. And I just cashed out some more Bitcoin, so I'm sitting at 95.67 um, worth of mined Bitcoin so far. Uh, 24 of that this week with 959 worth of Electronium so far. Uh, total value mine went up a little bit, 399.50. I think yesterday was like 386, but that was only because uh, I cashed out some Bitcoin from uh, Mining Pool Hub. So we'll hit that next. Here we are, Mining Pool Hub. Let me hit refresh, see if anything's changed. So right now I've got it set up on Electronium so that it will um, pay out at every 250 coins. So it, which it did that earlier. There was a bunch backed up on there and it just cashed out today. Um, got 17 unconfirmed with 44 confirmed. Um, let's go look at Ethereum. See what that 24 hour average is. 119.4 mega hash. 24 hour average is 0 0.0099. It's probably around $5 a day, roughly, I would imagine. Let's scroll back up, see what the hash rate is showing for Electronium. It should be around 1.6, I'm guessing. 1.48 moves around 190 average coins a day last 24 hours now we can go check out that rig here it is um, let's check out the hash rate so that hash rate is about for 1650 that's with the three GPUs and a CPU let's look at results um, 3025 Shares accepted, none rejected, so this rig's running perfect. No errors, good stuff, cards are running cool. 1070 Ti is 59 degrees, 1066 gig, 58 degrees, and a 3 gig is at 63 degrees. So everything is running good on that rig, and it's been up for quite a few days now, running good. We can go check out SMOS real quick. And I'm sure that um, everything is running fine on there. All right, so here we are in a control panel, 119.4 mega hash, like you guys just saw on Mining Pool Hub. Um, cards are running mid to uh, anywhere from a low to upper 60s, so everything's going good. Let me check out groups here real quick. And see if there's any more updates to the Claymore Miner. So I think I checked it last night and there wasn't any. Now we're still sitting at a version 11.8. So everything seems to be going fine with that. And as we um, saw earlier, market is still garbage. 66.96. Bitcoin sitting at right now. Let me see what the biggest gainers are. Loom Network, I'm sure you all have heard about Ethereum Classic being added to the Coinbase in the future. 1488. I was thinking about buying some just because um, it has been, you know, up in the 30s, so you could probably double your money. I would imagine after it becomes official and it's on Coinbase. So that price will probably go up anywhere from 50 to 100 percent. Again, that's just my speculation, but I don't know. It's kind of a. I like to get the coins. I'm sure if you follow me for a while, I like to get coins that are small in price, that have got a much more higher chance of an upside, like Tron does, like Verge does. Hopefully, it will. Electronium. I got Stellar Lumens. That's a fairly cheap coin. I've got Ripple now. Um, so that's what I kind of like to do. Get the smaller price coins. Bigger chance of them going up. Let's, Ripple's at 56 cents now. So anyways, guys, I'm kind of rambling on here. So that was um, that's it for the Tron news today and the mining rig news. Um, again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. If you guys have any questions or comments, just put them down below this video. I will get back to you. Um, 
tomorrow will be the intro to win video for Bitcoin Friday, so be on the lookout for that. And with that, guys, I think um, I think that's it for today. Happy mining, take care, and good day.